Welcome everyone to a Wednesday edition of Squad Ops One Life Event. Tonight we got Operation Spartan Trail on Corridon. We're getting the U.S. forces versus militia forces. I am Wilbur, doing a semi-quasi uh, solo cast tonight. I have some players dropping in after they go down to give you all a on the ground boots on the ground type of perspective after they go down we'll be getting boogie in here we'll be getting alpha guido in here we'll be getting killer man time in here and then of course a new thing that we've started is uh we'll be getting the commanders in after each round for the u.s side and uh having a brief discussion with them whether they win or lose just seeing you know how they felt everything was going how they think they probably could have done something different you know we'll see what happens and as i was saying we have tonight on court on bring up the op map for you situation is, is u.s forces have uh stranded tr uh u.s forces in that blue shaded zone on cora down there in the most southern west point of the map so the u.s forces need to locate the stranded squad and secure their location and then defend that location until the end of the round insurgent forces will be starting at the choosing hideout locations uh, and then insurgents must find and eliminate the stranded U.S. squad. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't know what the... I think those two maps, or those two uh, INS maps are where they can start. Pretty sure that is. But, yeah, the U.S. forces basically got to... Kind of yeah you know, just fly through this and talk to you all at the same time it's not working out and uh commands for tonight for round one we'll be getting wolfgang in command of the u.s forces you'll be seeing them in blue two ic will be evan rest of the sls will be cg foo boogie and sledvy and then over on the ins side we, in command we have jack two ic will be silent and then following out the rest of the sls is oddball miyamoto and lex ryan so those insurgent forces you'll see tonight in red both rounds we will be following the u.s forces and then loadouts for tonight the u.s are going to be getting one sl one ftl two ars and one medic and then across the entire platoon they'll be spreading out four lats and two engineers vehicles will be getting two mrap open top 240 bravo variant one logi truck with any load and then their reinforcement supplies will be one hmg tripod that they can set down once they find the uh, u.s forces and they'll be also be getting various defensive structures and then over on the ins they'll be getting one sl two ars one medic and then across the entire platoon they're going to get six lat rpg sevens uh leaving main at live they'll be getting one rocket artillery techie and two motorcycles and then after live they can scrounge any techie not at main be getting no fob and logistics and no command support you're gonna be in a objective one yeah put put gun away thank you sorry i forgot about that I wish we could shut these generators this, up. This looks like one of those fucking IED fuel. vehicles. Uh, v bed vehicles. Because it is. Alright, welcome everybody to the cause. Uh, Intel has been passed in through our spy network that there's a stranded US squad somewhere in the air. Uh, this cell has been tasked with locating that squad and destroying it before the US can come retrieve their wounded. The way we're going to accomplish this is we're going to divide the area up into three different search locations with Lux taking the north, Silence the middle, and Oddball the south. Yeah, so you guys see that compound in Charlie 878, and then there's another compound yeah, in Delta there. 711. Alright, um. Then the compound on the island and a tiny compound. Yeah, so Delta basically, the violence and action so and speed is key here. There's going to be a U.S. Them. platoon reinforcing this squad. We want to locate them and destroy them as quick as possible. If your chain of command starts to die, 
Uh, we just need to find whatever location they are, regroup Remember with another squad on the map, and we'll just continue gonna run right into it. Does anyone have any questions? If no questions, I'll need to break them out, let them know exactly where they're going. Let's have a good run. You're a bunch of filthy animals. So you're gonna rush those Americans. If we're Maybe terrorists... Yeah, an FTL stepping up and so it's like telling his people you, uh, what happens if they go down. Stuff. And we are live. Okay. Okay. Round yeah, one, Operation will, Spartan uh, Trail. As you see, the U.S. forces starting one, to push out. We're going to go down and see what kind of defensive posture Boogie has. It looks like the INS forces are pushing out as well from Maine. Don't know if oh Evans is gonna take the northern road. And it looks like INS is going north except for one squad that's hanging around down south. Let's try to see what Miyamoto is doing up here. If he's gonna be able to get any of his people to catch this uh convoy and they're pushing down south. They might hear them, but they're not going to be able to, I don't know. They got to get this road. They might come down. They might get one shot on them if he comes down this, if Evan brings his people down this road. Let's see which way they drive. And no, they're going to bypass. Maybe catch them another time. But they might run into this full INS force that's going way north. See squad four coming towards Boogie now. Boogie and Alpha in the same squad. Hopefully they don't both both go down at the same time and uh we get both of them in here. Commander disconnected again. Not good. Commander Evan on deck. We, we All right, I'm driving, so I'm putting confidence in Fu and Sled V to evade and get to Boogie quick, okay? No contacts reported this time. Good posture by INS forces. Yeah, wait till you peek that bridge. Just wait. They're kind of just sitting, waiting to see. Oh, heard an explosion. Maybe someone got hit with an RPG. Sled V, uh, this is squad one. Contact is on monolith. Oh, no, those are just uh, techies blowing up. Squad four, uh, this is squad one. I have cleared my guys hot to open up on target, so uh, we will engage before reporting over. This is four, I'm just... We're going to cross this bridge here. They may just completely invade INS forces out of sheer luck. It's taking that lucky route. Sorry to hear about that, Meep. Hopefully you uh, can get in session uh, one or session two on Saturday. Squad two, this is squad one. I always set a reminder for the ops. Even though I stream them, I still set a reminder. Squad two, we are about to have eyes on your northern flank. My so memory sucks. If needed, I will move another fire team to your north to shield you over. Copy. Uh, oh, we got some INS forces. Time is monolith, so, uh, Getting close. Point. There's some shots going out. Got Kuba real close. Alright, we have an ND. Oh no. <laughs> well, they know they're there now. I had an ND. Advise ND. Enemy contacts at Monolith. Let's see what Miyamoto's squad's doing all the way down there, and he's. Looks like they're still holding their position. They haven't moved back yet.
Here comes the fire. Full squad moving our southwest, southwest. I don't know which way to look. Oh, we're going right, right here. I'm about to start commanding in a sec. We're here. So if you're still on the wait list, stick around just in case something happens and you can get in on round squad two. Four, southwest, southwest of us. Enemy infantry spotted. Charlie nine, keypad nine. Directly west of my Infantry, fire tree, 200 Delta meters. Delta 10, Delta 10, 8, 4, we're suppressed. See Dorf Timeless and Toaster Waffle moving up. Hopefully they don't get caught out in the open crossing this road. I was taking pot shots at him. Timeless goes down. Try to hit someone with a shotgun. We're going to be covering your approach if you want to push up. Dark Lord's about to get flanked on both sides of Jenkins and Viper. Boogie, if I go down the lodge, he's at my current location, okay? Coming. Down goes Dark Lord to Jenkins. West side, down. West side. Try to see how this is going to unfold here. And down goes Boogie. Probably get him in here very shortly. Enemies directly south of two, about hundred meters. We're suppressing. What's going on, Boogie? Okay, do we have good Got one tap. That's what's going on, man. I saw it. Very important. Yeah, it seems like they kind of just snuck up on you all. Um, no, we had, we had, uh, confirmed contacts at Monolith, and then we started, uh, seeing guys southwest of us. We knew they were there, I just, uh, my squad didn't get, I guess wasn't able to hold that western, uh, side is the big issue. Yeah, you lost yourself and one other. Uh, you got Jenkins and Kuba basically pushing up from the west. Yeah, I assume that's why I got one tapped. We'll lose that point. Yeah, they're just they're sitting on a, a wall these guys are very good yep yeah i was interested to see how long it was going to take guy and s to actually get to you all They've look they have a Charlie majority of their forces up to the northeast who are now starting to come one, down one thing i'm very surprised about is how quick we got u.s forces here usually they're not here this quick so uh i think that's an, hey, do we have an added plus for us security? here like, it, no one, no one right saw the vehicles get down there. Or I think Miyamoto may have heard them. He was all the way up north at Mosque, and the vehicles just drove completely bypassing everyone unmolested. Copy. We see your contact at Charlie Nine Six. We're engaging. Very interesting. Copy. Now they've got that rocket already rolling. If they get that rocket already on this contact on this compound. It's very seven, open. Seven, it, seven, it will seven, devastate seven, seven, my guys on point. Push that real quick. Oh yeah, it definitely. Yeah, there's only like what those three buildings that you can hide in, and that's it. The MRAP has forces to the. Yeah, it's in those quick. cheese grater buildings are not good buildings either. <laughs> oh, it'll pass right on through. Especially bullets when they're walking up yeah. to them. Heavy right rain reinforcement. Delta it's actually not seven, as seven, big of a force as I thought it, it, it was previously. Uh, it, it was relayed to me as as maybe two squads. Um, ten, that's just something seven. that happens whenever you're you're in yeah, in the like stuff. Seven. People think that contact's a lot heavier than it actually Lord is. Should be on it, uh, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, the, the they saw they were so spread out that it kind of probably thought that. Oh yeah, well that's where we're getting all of the. If the hits and it looks like the mortar yeah the mortar is now hit, no the mortar is, mortar is actually uh, starting to hit head busta and frost up to the north so yeah hitting their own guys the rocket artillery boogie just went down um do you want me to try to get the logi up or is it yeah if you can get the logi up you're okay. you're able to put supplies this on is a, this is always one of the funner ops like trying yeah, to find I... a Stranded Enjoy. squad. I'm gonna try to move up to you guys. Hopefully nothing. It's uh, we we've had some definite, definite uh, clippable moments on this. Uh, my position in probably one of my favorites, being that it's a uh, a core up. Core ops are uh, 
We have quite a few of them, so we see quite a bit of them, but this is one of the better Roger, ones. Hold up there or even push on yeah, because, I mean, Korra is so flat, but they add all the vegetation to combat the flatness. Exactly. It's it's a very, uh, very uh, skinny map, so you're able to do a lot with ops on it, and I think that's why they definitely do have quite a bit on there, but it looks like our MRAPs have gotten up on a point. Really helps us out here. Oh yeah, especially if it's going to start looking in the center of that Maybe compound. Smoke, One thing I think uh, Wolfgang, he, he chose this compound because you're able to roll those MRAPs up. Uh, other compounds right, around so here, you're really not able to get some VIX in for some support. Close, which um, I'm gonna pull my squad I think in. is, is, uh, is a good, man, good choice here. Part, food, oh yeah, definitely a good choice. Um, some yeah, of the some of the walls clear. are a little high for the M raps, uh, but the wall the compound, I guess you can but, combat uh, no that by picking up good lanes of fire. Definitely, Black Miss is there. Silas on the gun, so you know it's gonna be good. Oh, I didn't realize. I thought he was driving. No, he is driving. Actually, you are right. Two forties though. Yeah. Not as strong. <laughs> no, doesn't 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 have the same punch. Wondering if uh, Revy has picked up these INS forces coming up on his northeast. See, that's one thing uh, you have to keep in mind as U.S. They do have that one uh, one squad that starts at Mosque, and it's basically chasing the United States the entire way. Three, right. Well, so it, if if your if your convoy doesn't get intercepted, over. it's very easy Copy, to yeah, to forget shots. about them. Okay, I got you. I'm gonna pull Alpha in. I guess he went down too. What's up, Alpha? How you doing? Uh, doing good. Yourself? I'm doing all right. Just having some discussions with uh, Boogie about you know the placement of the stranded squad. You, you lasted a little bit longer. I I did until Jenkins made me his tenth kill. Wait, is he really up to ten? He's up to ten. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got Jesus. one tap by him, dude. Yeah, I, I think I heard he was in my building for a while. I think I heard him. How does he do this every time? I don't know. God. Ten. He's very he's very hit or miss, it seems. Like, there's ops where he'll just pop off and get kill a full squad by himself. And there's other ops where he'll get, like, just a, a standard kill or two. I can't believe it. We've only been in this op for what? Not even 20 minutes, and he's already at 10 kills. Yep. Meanwhile, these rocket already are, are, are just not helpful. No, uh, they're missing have... completely. They're going to end up taking out people on their own team. Behind you now. I mean, he's not even hitting, on, oddball's not even hitting on the map. He's hitting off yeah. maps. I got too aggressive on that roof. My strategy with that little spot was to stay hidden for as long as possible and play the long game, but I got too eager. Popped oh, up Jenkins at the wrong time. Cut down. Oh. The reign of the Mad King ends now. <laughs> now Western flanks looking play. good, though. Oh, uh, yeah. We got a good uh, good def defense going. I think it's going pretty well, considering... For the location we picked, for sure. Um, they were able to get there on us really quick. Yeah, well, I wasn't so a fan of this location just south. because it. We we just he, you have to spread yourself like super thin to cover all the entrances. So when uh, one person dies, that's an entire time. flank just that's immediately collapsed. Yeah, Soon, I think you're right. Getting engaged from the rear and then when I lost uh, darks, so try to uh, out he, I had to cover that edge, and then that's when I got popped by Jenkins there. So, uh, go to, I so, yeah, I, I'm not sure if he was in my building, but I didn't even hear him until he was like he, shooting. He's in speaking there. on that wall. Okay. Yeah, he was on that wall towards the uh, western side of that uh, cheese grater compound. Gotcha. Yeah, I I heard people. The problem with that rooftop though was like every time I stood up, like I I was exposing myself big time. As you can see very well from everywhere up there. Yeah, that means they can see you very well exactly. from everywhere. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I did actually have a very nice spot. As little spot guys moving so southwest, because there's like a little crack there the I was rear. looking. And I could see right where Hedda is pretty much from out. that rooftop, wall prone. 
and a little bit. Squad one, we are still taking infantry contact from our east northeast. Uh, so it wasn't terrible, but infantry. it wasn't uh, we have the best. Casualties. Copy that. You're wasn't what you wanted. Here. No, it was not. Granted, my my plan was to play the long game, let my whole squad die, let the INS push onto the point, and then just kill him in the back from my ambush position on the rooftop. Huh. Didn't play out that way. Cause... <laughs> it's a nice plan, though. Yeah, it is. It's Sometimes people like Boogie have to die for you to do your thing. <laughs> There's a reason and... you got most like one of the most likely to bait. Uh, I was actually surprised <laughs> about that one. That was most likely to bait. I guess I... I... Typically, I don't Man, think I do that because I typically SL, east. and I we're deploying smoke and attempting to fall I, I think I, you kind of can't as an SL, but yeah, I fully understand the most likely limited war crime one. I think I've executed <laughs> you how many times as commander? <laughs> uh, twice, maybe. Yeah. Oh, that's that, that's just you though. It's uh, <laughs> I, I, I think I Go have. Go ahead, explain yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, there's no explaining it. I, I off people. I, no, it's no gotten to the point now issue. where it's gotten to the point now though where people know like when they just stand in the doorway and I pull out the gun, people don't do the whole "What are you gonna shoot me? You're not gonna do. It. You don't have the balls." Because people <laughs> and don't, then the don't, trigger don't goes. hesitate. Yeah, it looks like oh, no. some of the INS forces out here on the southwest side are trying to reposition. I think they know that they can't push through the center port of this compound. Got uh. Think they're kind of squeezing themselves on the map border, though. Yeah. Because that that's it's not going to help them. They, they got a full retreat, and even that's going to be difficult for them. Yeah, we got Imones and uh, Frenzy basically watching each corner. As soon as they come Piper's around. Piper's coming around right now. It's Oh, are they actually? Okay, yeah, you're right. Uh, I am interested to see how this will play out, though. The big thing is going to be if these guys that are right outside of the Northeast can get a move on because right now U.S. seems a little bit more disorganized with getting any kind of defensive setup. But, uh, I, I think Miyamoto's guys coming down here will be the deciding oh. factor on whether or not oh. INS wins this or loses it. Oh, Viper just took two to the head from my moments. Oh. <laughs> he just popped around the corner and whoop, whoop. Oh, here comes the rocket, Techie. For contact balls getting in on the fight. Soviet Piggy holding off of uh, Dwarf and Sledvy right now. Oh, he pulled, he... peeled back. Smart decision. Until Sledvy has it going. He gets shot again. <laughs> we are trying to push grenade. the compound to our west. It's... Oh, they're taking fire from uh, from the east now. They're taking Copy fire that. from Miyamoto's guys. Oh, they've caught up. How many guys do you think you're fighting? Oh, Fu went down. We are fighting and salty. I think it uh, looks like Jack peeked the corner and uh, killed two. Sitting at 14 kills for the U.S. and 22 for insurgents. Gee. Well, we should say 12 for insurgents, 10 for uh, uh, Jenkins. No, no, it is, it is, it is in cap. <laughs> so, oh, that's what you're talking about. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 10 for Jenkins, 14 for the insurgents. Yep. I think it's just going to be a matter of how how the INS pushed the US at this point. Um and reps are down, they killed the gunners. Um I'm a big believer in Potatoes me, law, so if you up. can miss that you will miss. I think this has turned into the patience game. Who's gonna Who's gonna pop out in the open first? Yeah. Obviously, the U.S. are in the defensive, but they're they only have a few people on the point, and like if just Miyamoto's guys collapsed in, they could uh, take them out. Or if the guys down here with uh, Dorf and Imanos, friend friends Renzi, and all them uh, U.S. Squad Four. Uh, they're actually at risk of getting pinched by squads two and three on INS. So if they're not careful, they're gonna probably Hello, bite the is, bullet. Uh, Dorf on squad four. And if they do, I I Dorf, can see uh, try to clear the whole the U.S. offense eventually collapsing. Yeah, that's not happening. All right, then just but get get back here. Again, it still relies on how aggressive and how coordinated the INS are with these attacks. Yeah, they're doing a pretty good job of kind of drawing the U.S. out, the field, the field, taking some pot shots at them, and then retreating back. 
Oh, uh, apparently Jack died recently. I, I missed that. I looked away for a split second. He was there and come back Evan, and he's dead. Evan's the only original squad leader still up. There's also two IC, though, so that kind of works. But, uh, yeah. And Dwarf's guys are in a bad spot here. They're got guys on their east, guys on their west. They can't really move. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. So 16 <laughs> of the INS kills are from two people. 10 from Jenkins and 6 from Jack as commander. Oh, <laughs> the commander, commander got six kills. <laughs> yeah, he was all because the U.S. was sitting around this ditch near where Lex Ryan and Headbuster are, and I know like three or four of them died in just in that area alone. Most likely the Jack who was peeking, I think, where Lex Ryan is right now. They're in the compound there. Yes, yep. he had Headbuster moving in. Spy's been in for a little bit too. He's just laying down in a bush. Yeah, Miyamoto squad coming in now might, uh, might be the, uh, yeah, the death blow here. Coming from your west side. West yeah. three. Although I wonder how well Slash is going to do under his MRAP. Is he hiding under an MRAP? Uh, not really hiding under, but next oh, to I see. and okay. keep leaning under. He's not pulling a full me with a Logi truck. You're not the only one that did that. Uh, Sergeant Jackson hid in one and killed like well, five he, guys. He, mm. the, 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 <laughs> he, he hid on top. I hid underneath. Yes, correct. Yeah, he was in he was in the bed of it. Ooh, Silas died. Yeah, he, that was took, an, yeah, he took an RPG Silas. round. Lat yeah, well the lat took down his uh the sandbags and then he got caught out in the open. Uh I'd imagine a screeching from that one he did. <laughs> <laughs> the George the only hope I, I see US is having this is if these Copy guys down south them. can pull back north, but I I don't see that happening. Nah, Dorf, if he moves his guys, they're going to get caught in the middle. Like, right out in the open. Well, now he has more of a, his east opened up, so if if he moves now, he's he's a little better than he was about two, three minutes ago. I think they only got... I only see... Right now, they, across the air, they only That's have the Nuke Dukem watching it, and he's using a PPSH right now, so I don't think he's going to be very good at what stopping the, them from the crossing. Kill, kill, and it looks like they are pulling back north. He's down. Oh, oh here spy. comes the assault. Never peek the same corner you got shot from. Evan's holding a really wonky angle right now. It's effective, though. Might be if he wasn't potatoing. There's two There's northeast, true. two northeast. Got it. And it's, I, I feel like if he's not careful, uh, R Herb and. Fluffs over here are going to, going to get him. Evan, where on the west side are they? Are they in this fucking building? Uh, I believe so. There's also a heavy east. Uh, let's see. Imanaz and Frenzy are now starting to make their way back. Uh, Dorf's already there. Frenzy might At actually, he's like, probably going to uh, kill by Oddball east. once he, nope. Oh, oh yep. Yep. <laughs> there he goes. Imanaz is probably like, okay. What way do he's I go? He's going to get peeked by Piggy, though. He's about to die. He ain't long for this earth. Oh, yep. Oh, yep there we go. Yeah. And down goes <laughs> Dwarf. And, oh, yeah, no. so that's, that's it. That's, uh... Yeah. It's Hero Be I Known think, and... Evan's down as well. Anatomic. It's pretty much Church. Yep. I told Anatomic to defend this location until his last breath, so... I don't think he's moved in the past five minutes, so... <laughs> no, he's he's been he's, he's been just... sitting there in the fucking little olive grove. He's pulling a liberal pundit. He he is doing what I told him to do, so I guess uh <laughs> little disappointed. Squad only got three kills. Kind of got jumped pretty quickly there. We did. Uh, again, I think it's the nature of this location. It's yeah. not. I was not a fan of it from the beginning, and I if I remember correctly, I, I let you. Let's I like that. I do like that uh you're able to get the MRAPs in here, but that they didn't use those quite how I thought they would. I mean the the map doesn't really allow that. Oh, here will be known as down, it's just anatomic left. <laughs> see how long it takes them to find him. Uh well I feel like anyone walking through here is going to see him immediately. Actually, uh... Uh, I don't know, Bob. Oh, yep. <laughs> oh, yep. yep. There you go. <laughs> He's still... yep, yeah, and that's, that's it. That's it. Yep. That is all she wrote. That is it. GG for round Church. one. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, thanks for popping down, guys. Uh, hopefully see you in, uh, no. Actually, I hope I don't see you round two. I hope you survive all the way to the end. Don't worry, you will definitely be uh, seeing Boogie very early yes, on round Yes, two. you will. <laughs> Myself, I will probably be shortly after him. Yeah. Uh, all right. These things tend to happen. All yep. right, thank you, Wilbert. Cheers, man. Yep, cheers. See you in five. Here we are live with round two of Operation Sounds a good round, guys. We really Spartan Trail. And we're seeing some of the INS forces move out no, now. We'll you down, Got one squad going north. Try not to leave me in the dust with the MRAPs either. I don't want to get sniped out. Maybe one down, straight down the start, middle man. and another down to the south. We'll see how close they get. And we'll see what Eyeball does. It looks like he's keeping all of his people inside of the compound. Ah, you're good. I'm right on full Don't want the, uh, the strand of platoon going down too quick. Looks like everyone's kind of just hiding. I don't see any heads poking out. No one's looking. Everyone's kind of just hidden. Maybe hoping they just walk right on past them. Good, uh, <laughs> sneaky. I like it. Just wait for them to come to you. You don't make any movements as I hear some techies going off. Explosion? Is there contact? That was just a vehicle exploding. Okay. That's not good at the moment. You're going to be fine, Adball. We're going to get you. Pepperoni Playboy, stop moving around. Coming, Adball. Don't give up hope. Stop moving around. Don't Everyone stay still. This is Bravo 6969 on route. I like this ploy with the uh, stranded platoon kind of just hiding. Really, probably just confused, <laughs> confused the shit out of INS. They'll probably pop their head out once uh, either four or two get to them. Where's Fu? Is Airy band of brethren. Probably uh, gonna hold there. Probably not. Might not see the vehicles, or they may see the vehicles. I just gonna relay some information, see where the vehicles go. Uh, go ahead and head on over to squadops.gg. Make yourself an account. And then after that, head on over to our Discord and link your account. Check the calendar that is on the website for a SOT Basic. After you take that SOT Basic, you can participate in these One Life events. And I will link everything for you. I think you missed it. Audio or eyes on anything yet, team? Negative from far. So there are the links to the website and Discord. And as I was saying before you came in, if you don't see a SOT basic on the calendar, right, just keep checking daily, three, three, four times a day, and eventually you'll find one and get in. Then after you take that SOT basic, you can come in on these uh, One Life events. Here we go, Jenkins. Leading, leading himself and the rest of his squad. Almost headlining. Ooh, maybe they already spotted him? There's no way. There is no way they already know where they are. They've been hiding. What? How did that? How did they know? Good guess. Oh, oh, here we go. Popping off. Looks like Jenkins and his squad. Uba going for a mad lad flank.
Uh, no, just pull and get ready to start building defenses. The we got, uh... Got Kuba and Jenkins in the same yeah, squad. Delta 829. Delta Silent was in there, too. Rod. A little OP. Nice nade. Whoever threw that, that was a good one. Whoever it was, you yeeted that one. Yeah, check out all the Remy's on the top of the Discord channel. Uh, a lot of a lot of questions that you'll have can be answered in there. If you can't find what you're looking for there, check the uh, ask in one of the help channels. Like Kuba tagged Remix. Squad four using the MRAPs. Let's start to uh, try and win the battle, the, the fire spirit battle. Squad two, if you have to, uh, push more south and wrap around that contact. I'd like you to try and get, uh, try and get to Delta 856. Did you say this contact Delta 893? Somebody just called that out. Uh, negative, I didn't hear anything. Right, Jones. Jack, I'm going to dismount from my guys Orc. support for if you Getting want. a little close to the compound. Keep those 50 cals rocking, or the 240s rocking from the, the MRAPs, though. Yeah, yeah. Haven't seen Fu come in yet. He's still up there. He's working his way north to come back down behind everybody. Might get a nice little pinch movement. And I think there is something wrong with the rocket techie. Delta it, eight, it's five, been off six, all night. Delta eight, five, six, enemy infantry. And I'm sure we have people manning those that know what they're doing. Oh, wow. Almost missed this Miyamoto's squad. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Alpha got three. Or maybe Dark Lord and Alpha. So you're facing a 45 to it, then lean. I don't know what that discussion was, but uh, nothing was popping up on mine. Sauce is putting down some fire. Be advised, we got enemy Who was that? Was that Alpha? Oh, Dark Lord got two. Ooh. Out there. Found a Sasa and WG and Killer Man. Uh, we still contact uh, along the map order or west and guys at school. Doesn't look like Boogie's gonna go down first. Roger, take your time. Go slow. Oh no, I didn't. Yep, and Miyamoto and Gonzo guy, they're still up. Roger. Jack, we're just up here. Force is lost three. Back. We'll push up if you want us. Yeah, yeah I need All to walking into that fatal funnel, and right here we go. We got Dwarf, Toaster, oh, Waffle, yeah. and Timeless. Timeless. What's this on? Getting ready to breach the compound. Oh, they're gonna come through that door and I'm gonna whack them as soon as they do. I'm gonna wait until if one of them looks at me and then the I'm man's up. Otherwise I'm gonna wait and see with the stranded squad, Dorf's gonna pull back. One time casually on stranded squad. Only lost one. Hey, just look guys at the map order north. Maps, watch out. One M wraps up. Here's the other one. Did you lose an M wrap? Oh, nope, there's the other one up there. Rusty Shackleford and Headbuster. Rus one, you can pull the M wraps back all the way oh, around. There's back Dwarf. Towards the bridge and Pulling back seven. using his binos, trying to, to find to people. If you can't see some movement inside the compound. Up on the south side with squad two and shoot them. Looks like Jenkins' squad's done a really good job of stopping this northern push. Yeah, those rocket artillery is way off. They've been off all night. I not. I don't think it's the gunner. I think there's something wrong with the rocket techies. All right, Jake. We're moving to fax up. Break two. Enemies west of you. Be careful. Squad 2, they're on our wall. They're on our south wall, squad 2. 
Jack Don't calls out timeless and toaster waffle copy, moving copy. around. Copy, copy, we're coming. Yeah, keep comms clear, comms clear, this is Tommy. They are in the building, Delta 856, south of the objective compound. Eyeball calls him out across the river. Jake has just got one tapped. Uh, oh no. That's it, we're fine. Other than that. I'm okay. Jenkins. Yeah, just keep holding there. If you can take ground, if not, just hold that angle. Okay, just for one sec. Jenkins is down. I don't know what. Oh, a lat hit. Got Gonzo. Yeah, leave that one MRAP there to support four. Take the other MRAP south to uh, support two on the south side. I like it. Looks like Miyamoto's squad yeah, is Charlie, Charlie says that they can't push, they get bottlenecked. So we're What's going on, killer? Okay, what happened? Squad two. Squad two, make sure we're that, getting uh, ambushed. No one's coming by. Oh no, there's Miyamoto. Copy, yeah, we're getting shoot and up. WG. Move, Is Kerr uh, with you east. also? Let's get out of here. We'll try to wrap around. Yeah, MRAP is disabled. We're getting hit close. Some of us are probably gonna go down. Raj, there's a squad in our position. Tell you guys to announce. Yeah, there was about three of them that all walked through a doorway at the same time. They all walked through the fatal funnel at the exact same time and just got wrecked. Be advised, you got a squad size element come behind you from Orchard area. Let's let you guys know. <laughs> okay. okay. That's how. That's all. That's always how it happens. But you survived the entire round last round. Just take it. Just take it. <laughs> well. It wasn't Alpha and it wasn't Boogie that took you all down. Or maybe later on. I've been I've been watching Dwarf trying to get to the stranded squad. But I don't know if if well let's let's check the kill count. Boogie doesn't have anything and oh Alpha Guido's got two, so maybe he got killed by Alpha. So if he all goes if he goes down you can uh you can heckle each other. No, oh, Boogie, Boogie has zero kills. It's Alpha and Dark Lord. And Dark Lord was the one who uh, wrecked everyone walking through the door. Uh, yeah, it was a good compound to hold, though. It's just people moved out too fast. As we see... CG Foo squad coming up from the east, or from the east, left from the east, whichever way you want to call it. Yes, east direction. And Headbusta and Rusty Shackelford sitting here with the 240, uh, basically keeping Silas uh, from poking five, his head five, up. Same with your nightmare. All right, just harden up, and we're gonna wait till they try breaching, and then we'll. Just fight them gorillas and jack is just saying hey we're just gonna hold yeah, these positions over. and just wait for I them to po the put put poke their heads out the squad sitting with six kills for the u.s and 13 for insurgent cover. forces i mean looking at the layout it definitely looks like u.s has the advantage but when you look at the kills ins does Sometimes location wins. How are comms going over there on the INS forces? Uh. Strand is still almost full strength, so it might be best to just leave everybody where they are. Yeah, that's fine. We're just going to harden up right and wait to see what the enemy is. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Sounds yeah. Good. It, I mean, you can set up the greatest plan in the entire world, but if everyone dies within the first five seconds, your plan doesn't work. You got to re-strategize re it. 
I was gonna say strategize. I caught myself. Strategize. It's the new. It's the new version of Scrabble. Instead of words, you're putting plans together. <laughs> well, I suck at a lot of games. Squad being one. Nah, I'm okay on it. Head bust does it going with one. How many effective are you at? I've been. Currently, we just lost one. I think we're at three effective. Well, at least you know you can hit the broad side of a barn. Running pretty far away. <laughs> if you're hitting yeah, the wall, yeah, sorry, you're hitting the broad side the wall, of the barn. Oh, and here comes Wolfgang tossing in some grenades. Yep, footsteps, footsteps. At two of them, they're calling out footsteps. Duke Nukem's got a nice, or Nuke Nukem, got a nice little pinch spot. Same with Silver. They kind of got all of the entrances covered. Shut up, shut up. Like, U.S. have just been sitting in this compound, just hiding the entire time. I wouldn't say hiding, but not peeking. they not peeking. Yeah, I think they were just waiting for you all to just walk right past them. Right. I mean, they get defensive structures, but I don't think they had time to actually build any defensive structures. Uh, so they're the just going to have to use what's one, in the game. Two people just inside the compound. There's two people. Raj. Oh, you mean when no one would shoot the uh, wood floors? South, south, south. Oh, down goes Nocturnal. Rushed through a doorway too fast without checking. Got to peek those corner. You got to pie the corner. Right, you guys seen those enemies behind us? Really... I got eyes on the. Uh, there's no one. Guys right oh, it's They're nothing not to do with math. It's, it's all about looking. Right all about using your eyes. Yeah, oh, also, jeez. And Fu's squad has been called out. Still got Soviet Doge and Hedda up on the north side. Kuba and D-Leak are moving across the street towards Fu. Kuba knows they're there. I think he's just going to hold this wall and wait for them to come out into this, uh, I want to say lavender field. D-Leak going into the road, moving down in the open. He up. Oh. And he goes down, leaves Kuba by himself, and we got a team kill. No. The worst thing to see. The worst. That's the first team kill of the night. South Wall, well, I'm surprised it hasn't down. been the rocket artillery, because I don't think it's the gunner. I think there's something wrong with it. It has been off all night. And I mean by like 300 to 200 meters. No, it's down to East Ham. South East, South East. Edward, South East. It was hitting off the, hitting off the map. I think there's something wrong with it. Maybe someone was using like an old calculator and they've updated the, the gradients for it and didn't tell anybody. Oh, Viper, look to your left. Look to your left, Viper. Getting into this compound is going to be hard for INS unless they have a bunch of grenades. And I think they've used all of them already. Oh, Viper missed. Yeah, Viper's still up. Uh, someone just went down trying to pass through. Dwarf's in. No. 
Viper finally goes down. Pepperoni Playboy got eyeball up and up top. I mean, it's the, they got a lot to go through. I mean, they got Oddball and Phoenix and Jack. Uh, Nuke Dukem, Silver's in here. Meatball's got an AR just watching if they come outside. Yeah, Kuba's down too. Oh no. Up, oh, up, oh, Miyamoto's out there. Down goes Eyeball. Chicken's up on a roof. He goes right, down. Dead. Dead. Hey, I got a shit ton of hostiles approaching your north. Towards the compound, directly north. As Miyamoto calls him out on the north side, Wolfgang and Alpha Guido. On goes Wolfgang. That's a lot of red coming in on this few little blue. Oh, come on, Miyamoto. Oh. Still got Silas and Nightmare. I don't know what they're doing up there. Vehicle's down. They're waiting in reserve. Yeah, you ready, guys. There's some confidence on the INS side. Hey, we don't need you. They just came in. They just... Yeah, have some reserves. Eatballs needs the... He needs to lay off that trigger. Depression is good, but don't go, don't burn your ammo. I got guys coming in the side again. I'm watching. Reload sniper. Oh, that's not good. What's going on, Alpha? Got a yeah, you killed killer. Yeah. And down goes Boogie and Anatomic. And I want to say that Dorf is the luckiest person in the world. He just had an AR full open on him and didn't even, didn't even like get a scratch. Nothing. Well, and I've had you all muted for the past like 10 minutes. People are probably thinking, who is he talking to? Well, uh, uh, I was apparently the the one who killed Killer, so... Yeah, you, you Alpha missed. killed Killer. I've been sitting here talking to Killer for like 10 minutes. Uh, I just happened to think, uh, like, wait a second. That, Renegade Texan, right before he died, managed to kill uh, Command. And I'm actually surprised, for be, it being this point, I'm, I'm quite surprised uh, we did well, this well. It's, I mean, I've, it's still... They're still holding it. Dorf West went down. Right, uh... Yep. It's honestly still anyone's game at this point, but this point's always been notoriously like hard to assault, especially when they get the reinforcements in and around. Yeah, and they've been holding this compound pretty good, and Silver just dodged a grenade. Yeah, that's sixth sense. It's it's down to five people. How did Miyamoto get into this compound running behind all of these INS forces? I'm telling you, the man has no fear. He runs through open Ooh. fields all the time. Hedda just got killed trying to come back. I think he got spotted by Remick and Silent or Silas. Eesh. And we still got Soviet Doge running through a field. Let's see what let's see if he get, let's see what kind of luck he's got. Probably more than I do.
I'm just waiting to see when Meatball Warrior runs out of ammo. Huh. Um, how many has he killed so far? Meatball is at two. Ooh, Dixwell's gonna die. Oh no, Dixwell got him. Holy shit. Oh, God. Oh no, that's bad. Uh, hold up. Down to Miyamoto, Phoenix, Hedda. Oh no, not Hedda. Soviet Doge, Phoenix, and Miyamoto. Doge opens up on Hun and Nightmare. I don't know what the Don was thinking. Oh, wait. Lagger's up too. So we still got Lagar, yeah. Miyamoto, Phoenix, Soviet Doge. He takes a round. He's going to have to bandage. No, Soviet Doge isn't up. Oh, wait. No, that's yeah. Soviet Piggy. Yeah, that's Soviet Piggy. Okay. We have too many Soviets. What's going on, Buggy? I do agree with the, the amount of Soviets in this uh, in this community. <laughs> Soviet Doge, Soviet... Who, 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 we got... Comrade, some, Comrade Nuclear Twister. Soviet Piggy, yeah. There's a lot of Soviets for a non-Soviet campaign. Uh, I got smokes. I got two of them, but I'm at like one third health here. So, down to Miyamoto and yeah. Phoenix. Also, what we got for now. They're just trying to get across. I think it's all the on their west right now. Still don't see how Miyamoto yeah, even got into this yes, compound. We can, if you have the right cover. If we can block that AR as line of sight. Um, honestly, right I'm questioning that too. It's like, I, I think every, like, he probably slipped right, right, right next to INS forces and they didn't even realize it. Okay, you're right. On the roof, on the roof, on the roof. I can believe it. Just get I'd believe it. I mean, they're in the absolute worst position. Remick throws a grenade in. Oh, However, that building, though, off. it's tiny, but they got a ridiculous-looking barrier in there. That's actually... Ah, that's that smart, is, actually. Yeah. I, uh... Oh, Phoenix I'm, didn't use it. I'm upset that I didn't think of ever doing that. Because that's, uh... That's legal placement, but it's not like a sandbag that, you know, will get dropped down with uh, grenades. Wait, is that a placement? I don't think that's a placement. It is a placement. Yeah, it is a placement. placement. It is? Uh, the yep. Jersey mm -hmm. barrier, yeah. It's uh, it's not on the build menu, if I remember correctly. When, for the mod on the T-wheel, it's like right there, along with the little check hedgehogs. Oh. That's dirty. Whenever we do, whenever we do ops that require building a... Uh, a roadblock. Like roadblock, I'll always put those up instead of sandbags, because they just look cooler. Remick is just waiting for Miyamoto to change positions. He's so beelined on him. <laughs> Remick's a good shot. Miyamoto makes that wrong move, and he's done for. Oh, and Hun oh. pokes down just in time. Got all these little... Nats. Oh, man, they are going to rush Oh, they're him. stacking up. Yeah, he's... Miyamoto they're running the rabbit. Time. They're running rabbit. Oh, Damn. Oh, wow. Down he goes. That was very well executed right there. That was a nice looking... at the worst time. Yeah, yeah, that was definitely nice well, looking. Well, I mean, he also had the disadvantage of that small corner he was peeking around. If you look at it, only gives him so much to shoot from from the ground oh, yeah. floor. So once they get past a certain point, he's got to get up. Yeah, I think that's what happened when uh, the second Nightmare entered that building. Uh it's done for. But that's the problem with holding tight angles in this game. Uh, running rabbit like that is the perfect counter to a tight angle. Yeah, absolutely. I, I'm going to pull Jack down. Get a discussion going on with him. What's going on, Jack? How was, uh, what was your take on U.S. positions for uh, the second round? You there? Hey, can you hear me? Yep, I can hear you. Hello? Hey, yeah, uh, so basically the plan was to rescue our down squad. Uh, we had two guys on, on foot, two squads on foot move in, and then we had the third squad pull in with some MRAPs. Uh, it didn't really pan out exactly how we had envisioned, but I hope everyone had fun. 
took him yeah. down to, i think seven or six guys left at the end so i'm happy with it yeah it was a, definitely a good plan uh loved watching it unfold and i uh, can't wait to see you uh command again thank you it's fun like always all right man i uh, will talk to you in a little bit for sure All right, everyone, uh, that is Operation...